What do you mean Twix is getting on in years? Oh, I'm not ready for that. Hey, if you want, welcome to my channel and welcome back to the 100 horses challenge. All right, so it is nighttime. Riley's currently asleep. I'm seeing a lot of excellent. I'm seeing a lot of good and I'm seeing a lot of not so good. But I think we're okay to fix that in the morning. I don't see any starving. Just puzzles is not doing great. Oh, food. Lobster made by our butler. Don't mind me if I put that in the fridge. She's also eating the brownies that were made by our caterer so now that we have an oven our butler is cooking more often so maybe we didn't have to hire a caterer but i think it's all right though i enjoy having a bunch of food and not having to worry about it and not having to have microwaves or quick meals all of the time so let's pee through the night riley did go to bed at a reasonable time so hopefully we can kind of fix her sleep schedule how's puzzles doing are we dying Oh, yeah, not good. Okay, keep an eye on that. Because I would love for Riley to sleep. But also, I really don't want my horse to be taken away. Super do not want my horse to be taken away. Really would rather not. We should probably just get up. She should get up. She should wake up puzzles and just give her some food. And then we can go back to bed. Oh, hi, it's the vampire. Okay, please be nice. Thank you. You like animals, right? That's why you were at Animal Ranch Day, right? Yeah. You can hang out with the animals forever now. Isn't that what you wanted? Puzzles, don't run away. Okay, one more prairie grass. And then we'll go back to sleep for a bit. And then she'll wake up at a reasonable time. And it's all going to plan. I think this is the first day that we have not as great weather. Like, it's always been sunny. It's, it's like it's really we're really getting into fall now the leaves are turning orangey brown we've got a pile of leaves but that's been there for a while like really genuinely going into fall wait why did the snapdragons die they were here just the other day what's that about okay i think she's all right in terms of energy renjan is playing piano <laughs> of course she is okay let's have some lobster miss fancy pants over here having some lobster for breakfast i love that we're struggling to pay our bills right every single time our bills show up we just like really struggle to pay them she practically just aged up from being a teenager and we're also eating lobster for breakfast and we have a butler <laughs> just love that that's our life okay, her main issue right now is that she really needs some fun go for a ride because that's fun wait let's check the horses doing well doing well all excellent hygiene low but she'll be fine for a little bit probably spaghetti's low on fun great because if we go on a ride let's go for an intense ride that's fun for both the horse and riley i think i hope all right off we go off 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 we go let's go for an intense ride please is the game not working okay we're going somewhere and now we go for an intense ride yes okay oh den lion is low on hunger that's not great puzzles is fun poor but is being taken care of by the ranch hand are you gonna eat there's prairie grass there's food you can just eat you know you you could just eat maybe we should go back her fun is almost up that way we can feed Dan the lion. Or are you gonna eat? Oh, she is, okay. Did not have to cancel the ride because Dan lion is eating. I feel like they're a little bit less energetic than they usually are. Is it because the weather isn't great? Like even Mango is sleeping and Mango is always running around. Okay, let's fix the horse barrels and ask our horses to jump because I think they're doing all right. So puzzles can jump and spaghetti can jump and then we'll mount mango because that way we can intensely train and get that skill up okay that wasn't a very successful training session because both of our horses already knocked over the jumps it's all up to you now mango let's make this a successful one shall we what is happening here like why are we bar what the barrels are still interacting but our horse is all the way over there. Like, look at the barrels wobbling sometimes. What's up with that? That's so weird. Look at our ghost barrels. Oh, I forgot to do the animal ranch day. We usually do an animal ranch day. I mean, we can still do that. The ranch hand is leaving now. So when she gets off the horse, we can just plan a social event. I don't think there's a time limit for that. I'll let her train for a bit, though. We should also not forget to take care of the garden. Because I think I forgot to harvest last time, which means we kind of missed out. No, what do you mean? What do you mean? mean Twix is getting on in years I feel like we just got Twix oh I'm not ready for that not our mini animal I feel like I got to barely hang out with you no but Twix is so cute I don't want to say goodbye to Twix Twix is getting on in years the poor old fella hope there's a few more pets left till the reaper comes for a visit I guess we just get the notification and that's it 
French Animal Day, I suppose. Well, at least the mini animals are getting a whole bunch of attention now that I do French Animal Days pretty much every single day. Animal tender today is Serena, so not one of her moms this time. And then, like I said, let's not forget to harvest all of the plants we got. I am gonna sell the grapes because we have more to harvest now. So that gives us 2,000 simoleons, which is nice. Oh, hunger low, social poor. She's a little bit tired. It is 11 p.m. So I guess that makes sense. We'll plant a couple more green beans. Sell the rest. 190. No, you have to feed the animals. I know you want to go to bed. Okay, let's ask to eat again. No? Ask horse to eat. No? Ask horse to eat? Maybe over here? Is it too far away, maybe? Okay, we'll try over here. Ask to eat. No? Nope. Nope. Okay. Bottle feed again? Where is the foal? Over there. Are you gonna eat? No. Ask horse to eat. Why doesn't it work? It's also 3 a.m. I thought we were going to bed at a reasonable time. But now she literally spent all night trying to get Jigsaw to eat. I just don't want our foals to be taken away, you know? Are we eating? Yes. Okay, good. Now she can go to bed. I bet other horses aren't doing great now, but I'm just gonna ignore that and hope I'm wrong. No, okay. Did you have to pass out? Like you were almost at the bed and then you walked all the way over there just to pass out? Really? No, not oatmeal was well, Open was getting on in years. The poor old fella. Hope there's a few more pets left until the Reaper comes to pay a visit. I cannot accept that. I'm sorry. I open when Twix are immortal, and that's the only answer. We don't do that here, you know. We don't. We don't take away mini animals. They are immortal. They don't die, right? Please. I mean, look at the little thing. It's so cute. Can we just not? Like, can we just have them forever? All right. I think it's time to get up. We should probably start a social event as well. Let's fix the horse jumps. I want to propose a new rule because I thought it'd be fun to kind of incorporate horse competitions a little bit into the challenge. So I thought maybe a new requirement for being able to move a horse into a different household would be to place first in a master level competition. So any of the master level competitions, if they manage to place first in that, I can move them out. So either two skills to level 10 or place first in a master level competition, which essentially still means that they have to have pretty high skills because as you can see for the barrel racing competition, they need to be agility level nine and endurance level five. And then they also need to win. So probably a little bit higher than that. But I thought that'd be like a nice additional rule we could add for another condition to be able to move out the horses. So let me know how you feel about that in the comments. Okay, let's mount Mango. Because what I wanted to do was go for a ride, potentially. Because I wanted to enter a few more competitions, but we placed third last time in the barrel racing competition. And it was mostly because, because her endurance skill wasn't high enough. So I just want to go for an intense ride to get up some of that endurance skill. Meanwhile, Spaghetti and Puzzles are working on their jumping skill as they do. Ooh, not quite there, but they're pretty much leveling up at the same speed. So they're almost at six. And Mango just acquired the endurance skill. Because just to check, what's the requirements for an intermediate barrel racing competition? Because we did beginner last time. Agility level 5 and endurance level 3. So still a little bit to go. But it looks like they're doing all right. Especially because they're going on an intense ride. It's going up pretty fast. Almost at level 2. And Riley is going to level up to level 9 horse riding skill, I think. Let's speed through a little bit. Reached endurance level 2. Which also means she becomes less fatigued when using horse barrels or jumps. So that might also mean that... They can train a little bit longer. Oh, reach jumping level six. Both of them still training. Is Mango still doing all right? Hunger low. I think we can at least train for a little bit. No, we can't. In that case, we can just hand feed so we can get her hunger up if she doesn't run away immediately. Oh, look. Her mom is a guest this time. She definitely fell in love with animals. Like, there's no way she didn't. I mean, look at that. She's here more often than Kaylin these days. So how's that hunger doing now? Good. Okay. So let's mount again and then intensely train. Spaghetti and Puzzles are both still jumping. Puzzles is about to level up. Isn't doing great though. So I hope she quits soon. Spaghetti's just stuck. Should we reset objects? We'll reset both of them because hopefully that way will you know, start taking care of some of those needs because, oh my God, we really need to take care of some of those needs. Can I go eat? Yes. Okay. In that case, we probably shouldn't worry. We'll just keep barrel racing. Reach horse level riding nine. Riley is unlikely to become very confident while riding a horse due to her riding abilities. 
So she's now feeling confident. Only one level left until she reaches level 10. I'm very, very curious to see if that influences anything. Apparently our green beans were planted as well and also fully grown. And Mango reached agility level 8. I think that's time for us to stop riding. She should probably take care of some of her needs. Let's see if the garden needs anything. Is there anything to harvest? No. Okay. If any of the horses need our attention or... Hmm. 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 <laughs> They probably should. Okay, let's actually go take care of some of the horses then. Jigsaw's gonna age up in three days. I don't think we're gonna be able to get that temperament skill up fast enough for that. Oh, <laughs> we're, we're taking care of horses on horseback now. Let's see if we have any finely aged nectar. It seems like it. Okay, so we have a poor bottle, which is worth a thousand. A normal bottle for almost two and a half thousand. And another normal bottle. We should probably make some more bottles of nectars pretty soon because we're running out of our collection. Okay, I think the horses are fine. She should probably eat and then go to sleep. I feel like we're really getting somewhere now. Like so many of our horses are doing pretty well in terms of their skills. I think the foals might age up in the next episode. Like we're really, really getting somewhere now. So don't forget to subscribe if you don't want to miss out on the next part and like this video if you enjoyed it. And as always, thank you so much for watching and I will see you again very soon. Bye everyone!